What's up guys, Brandon Fisher here with Fishy15.com. In this video, I'm just going to be showing you guys how you can downgrade from iOS 6 betas to iOS, let's say, 5.1.1. So you can actually downgrade from iOS 6 betas to iOS 5.1.1. I've been getting tons and tons of questions ever since I've been helping all you guys upgrade to the betas. So you can, in fact, downgrade to 5.1.1. If you want to go any lower than 5.1.1, You'll need to use some of the other other ways to get down there, like with Tiny Umbrella and stuff like that, if you've got your SH, SH blob saved. Um, because Apple is still signing 5.1.1, that is the only reason you can um, downgrade to that. So make sure you have 5.1.1 down, um, downloaded. As you can see, I've got it right there, and I've also got 6.0 just because that's what's on my device. I will be showing you guys how to do this on an iPad, so the new iPad, but this will work for any device you want to downgrade. And again, you have to go to 5.1.1 unless you have um, your blob saved for other firmware. So if you want, go ahead and plug it in. And now we are going to hold down the power button and the home button for 10 seconds. And it should power off here. And then let go of the power button here and continue holding the home button. The Apple logo should appear, and then now you should get that your device is in DFU mode. So something should pop up in iTunes as well, as you can see here. Go ahead and set your device aside, hit enter, and then now you can do an alt restore. So hold alt on your keyboard and click restore if you're on a Mac. If you're on Windows, go ahead and hold shift on your keyboard and click restore there. Now I'm um, navigating to my desktop here, and I'm going to go ahead and click on 5.1.1. So once I click that, go ahead and hit restore, and um, this will take quite some time. So I'm going to actually come back to you guys when it is done. And it's as easy as that, guys. I am now on a fresh restore of 5.1.1. And now you can just go ahead and set it up, click your language, your country or region, um, location services, and your Wi-Fi, all that good stuff. And I really hope this helped you guys. This is just showing you guys how to downgrade iOS 6 betas to 5.1.1. And if it did help you, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button for more videos. If you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, be sure to drop a comment below in the comments section. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace.